Hey guys, this is Rob, just showing you my uh, tool changing 13 head printer. So what makes this thing tick is clippers of firmware using a Raspberry Pi and five Arduinos. I'll post the code on GitHub and I'll post this STLs for the uh, um, tool changing parts on uh, um, Thingiverse. But if we come around to the back here, pardon the mess, we can see the Raspberry Pi down there on the ground, go into USB hub, which goes to these three ramps boards. So you can see the one on the right over here isn't doing anything. This one here is powering these two stepper drivers that run the XY motors. And then down here is the Z um, uh, ramps board which controls all the z-axis and the z-homing and everything else. Uh, the harness right here is for all the fans so I can turn all the fans on and off. But uh, um, the beds, the bed heater is uh, um, 120 volts so that's the MOSFET down there next to the green filament and the power supply for the rest of the system there. Um, I don't run any of my printers without a smart outlet tied into the Raspberry Pi so the Raspberry Pi can turn it off after my smaller tool changer decided that it wanted to stick a heater on. Luckily I was right next to when that happened. But uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and post the uh, the code that I'm running on Clipper on GitHub um, probably about five minutes after I upload this video. So yeah. Alright guys, if you have any more questions, please do let me know. Um, I'll continue to share this information. I am going to be at Earth with this printer and my other tool changer printer, sorry that was the cat, and just as a bonus, a polar printer, which I didn't know anybody else had made until I looked it up online after I made mine, but this one has a flexible bed and can dump the print off by spinning the bed 360 degrees after it's done printing. Alrighty guys, again, if you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.